Ever wonder what would happen if a 500 foot wide asteroid slammed into Earth? Spoiler alert, it wouldn't be good. The impact could decimate an entire city or trigger a massive tsunami if it crashed into the ocean. The odds of this actually happening are low, but NASA wants to be prepared in case a city killer asteroid sets its sights on our planet. That's why scientists launched a DART mission in 2022. The mission ran the spacecraft into the asteroid moonlet Dimorphos, which orbits a larger asteroid called Didymos. NASA aimed to change the amount of time it takes for Dimorphos to complete one full circle around Didymos. This was a test of the kinetic impactor technique, a strategy that NASA could eventually use to deflect a dangerous asteroid away from Earth. The mission was an astounding success, but now new research suggests that using this technique is more complicated than scientists thought. A satellite called Lycia Cube took images of the DART spacecraft as it smashed into Dimorphos. Scientists recently analyzed those images to take a closer look at the mess this mission left behind. The debris ejected from the surface of the asteroid didn't behave the way they expected. Large boulders blasted away from Dimorphos at speeds at up to 160 miles per hour, and most of them short south. This could have caused the asteroid to tumble out of control in space. This unexpected outcome means we can't rely on the kinetic impactor technique to save us just yet. For now, we'll have to rely on asteroid detection, tracking, and a little bit of luck to keep us safe from city killer asteroids. Fortunately, the odds are in our favor. For more on this story and stories like these, tap our link in bio and visit gizmodo.com.